Hi, I'm Christian Bidner, Safety Product Manager for Gary Electric. I'm going to be presenting to you Rockwell's newest rope pull switch, the Lifeline 5 series. Before I start on the Lifeline 5 features and benefits, let me clear up some confusion that some machine designers have when it comes to emergency stops and rope pull switches. First of all, emergency stops and rope pull switches are not considered safeguarding devices in the machine guarding world. CSA and ISO standards that conform to the hierarchy of con controls concept define these devices as complementary protective equipment. In other words, e-stops and rope pull switches do not detect or prevent someone from reaching the hazard on a machine. They are used in reaction to an incident or the hazard situation that is about to occur. occur. Therefore, these safety systems designers should not consider these to be primary safeguarding devices. Those devices are light curtains, scanners, or some type of interlocked guarding systems. Ropo switches and e-stops should be complementary to the primary guarding devices and act as the last resort to stop a machine. The Lifeline 5 series of Ropo switches is an upgrade in technology to Rockwell's best-selling Lifeline 4 series of Ropo switches. It has the same mounting profile, so it's backward compatible. It can come with quick disconnect versions and with or without emergency stops. And it uses the same installation kits as other Lifeline series Ropo switches. Let's get into more detail of what these upgrades in technology mean and how it can benefit machine builders and end users. The Lifeline 5 is the first solid state microprocessor based Ropo switch in the industry. By being a microprocessor-based device, it is able to attain a very high performance and cell rating, PLE or SIL3, by itself. This also means that in series connection applications will have limit effect on the PL or cell rating. It can cover a span of 100 meters. It has an electronic rope monitoring system that is capable of compensating for thermal expansions as well as inadvertent activations. It has a built-in margin indication that will help reduce downtime and has a wide temperature range of minus 20 degrees C to 75 degrees C Celsius. It has a 270 degree visible LED indication for diagnostics purposes and setup. It can come in a cast aluminum IP66 housing with an optional e-stop or an IP69K stainless steel housing configuration for SIP clean and place type of applications. It is available in either a 5-pin or 8-pin M12 connection making wiring very simple. Being in a microprocessor based device it also has solid state outputs. Traditional ROPO switches can have false tripping issues due to cable expansion and contraction because of temperature changes in their environments. For example, in the mining industry, the top of the mine and the bottom of the mine have very, temp very different temperature scenarios. You put in seasonal changes into that equation and you can see where cable contraction and expansion can easily occur. Another issue that can cause false trips is a worker accidentally leaning onto a cable if they try to get too close to a conveyor system. The new Lifeline 5 with electronic monitoring can help reduce some of these false tripping issues by ignoring extremely slow or slow activations of the rope. It also contains a tension indicator that tells when a readjustment of the tensioning system is needed before an accidental trip occurs. Another problem that can occur happens during the installation and commissioning stage of the rope pull system. In order to properly tension the rope pull system, an installer needs to adjust the tensioning device which can be located in the center of the span, thereby offering no view of the tensioning indicator on the actual rope pull. So there can be a lot of walking back and forth if it's a single installer or you need two operators in order to install this device correctly. The Lifeline 5 series has an LED system that indicates proper tensioning as well as marginal tension using a 270 degree viewable LED. This makes it easier to install, there's no running back and forth, and only one person is required to install the rope pull system, therefore saving time and money. Other problems with traditional rope pull switches which can cause downtime are physical damage due to abuse or misuse of the actual switch environmental conditions that can cause corrosion issues inside of the switch. 
The Lifeline Fine can mitigate some of these issues due to its rugged construction. It can come in die-cast aluminum or stainless steel versions with IP69K washdown ratings. An example where you would use these Lifeline 5 Ropo switches would be conveyor applications. Anytime you have someone working next to a conveyor or close to a conveyor system, a Ropo switch or some kind of emergency stop device is required. You can find these conveyor systems in material handling, distribution centers, food and beverage, as well as mining and automotive type of environments. Ordering of these rope switches is very simple. First of all, determine what type of enclosure you'd like to select, whether it's the die cast aluminum or the stainless steel version with IP69K rating. Then determine whether you require an additional e-stop or not, and then pick your connection system, whether it's a 5-pin or 8-pin M12 connections. The part numbers that are highlighted in gray are probably the most popular versions that we sell. Additional accessories are also available, such as the rope tensioning systems or stainless steel installation kits in various lengths and configurations. Inside and outside pulleys are also available, as well as turnbuckles. One installation note. Generally, in most installation, an additional spring is required to be installed opposite of the rope switch itself. So a typical BOM would look like a Lifeline 5 rope switch, some type of tensioning kit with rope, and then an additional spring. For further information on how to install these Lifeline 5 rope switches, or to get manuals, please visit the Rockwell Automation website or click on the above links. If you require pricing and availability information, please contact your Gary Electric account manager and he or she will help you. I'm Christian Bittner, Safety Product Manager for Gary Electric, and this is my presentation on the Lifeline 5 series of Ropal Switches.